10th race. Here they come. Source of muscles. Made a break, so did Wishes and Dreams. Real Classy is off stride. The rest are off and trotting. There goes Jute for the early lead. Problems for TK Small Source, who made a break at the start. And now Real Classy off stride, heading toward the first turn. Up front, Jute goes to the front of the field. April 7th has just made a break. So several trotters have broken stride behind Jute, who left from the far outside and now has a seven length lead going to the quarter mile mark. Pining for a try, moves up through a crowd of horses into second. Never pass, minds his manners, and as a result, he's third. Party House is fourth, off the quarter mile mark in 30 seconds flat. April 7th is back trotting and wide off the first turn in fifth. Racing, however, better than a dozen lengths off the lead. Real classy to his inside, followed by Source of Muscles as they make the move toward the half. Gap of three more to Wishes and Dreams, and TK Small Source trails after a break. Jute is on the lead by three lengths. Never pass, trying to move up into third, trying to collar, pining for a try to challenge for second. But he's still got ground to make up. The half in 101 and 2. Then beyond the top three, you've got Party House in fourth. A gap of three more to Source of Muscles on the outside of Real Classy. And then Saffron Job is next on the outside of Wishes and Dreams. TK Small Source and March, or rather April 7th, as they approach the three quarters. Again, the half in 101 and 2 and pining for a try. Moves up on the outside to challenge Jute. Only a half length between them. Pining for a try. Gently moving forward outside of Jute who has to lead by a neck. Gap of seven more to Party House. Third on the outside of Never Pass. And then Real Classy and Source of Muscles. Off three quarters. 132 and two. Pining for a try. Again, moves up alongside of Jute who cuts the corner and still has the lead by a half length. Pining for a try. Needs to find something more. He needs it quick. Jute is a stubborn foe today. Pining for a try. Comes at him one more time. Jute a short lead. Pining for a try. He's going to get it. Pining for a try. Gets up by a length on the line. Jute was second. Party House third. 2.01 and 4 the time for the mile. Driver Ross Leonard comes from a harness racing family. His father Terry, a longtime Illinois horseman. His uncle, the late Gary Leonard, was also a trainer driver in Illinois, and his late grandfather, Francis Bud Leonard, was a well-known and popular horseman from Harvard in the northern part of the state. Penny Yates making the trophy presentation, advocate for the Strategic Planning Council for Illinois Harness Racing. On the 10th race, the 3-9 exacta, $51.80. Here's the order of finish. It is official from the top. Never pass four. 